it's been that. Martin, apologies for not being there in person, but you know the understandable reasons for this. This is your day, and I know you don't like a lot of attention, um, but it's to celebrate your time with Brigade. Um, a little dicky bird tells me that um, you joined Brigade around 50 years ago as a young boy, and through a lot of hard work and effort, went on many training courses and progressed up to the ranks to eventually become one of the youngest regimental commanders in the UK. Following this, um, you were appointed to Deputy Governor, um, at which point I've spent a lot more time with you. You've helped steer the ship through some very rocky, turbulent waters, um, and we are now where we are in a lot better place than we were a number of years ago. You've had many highlights so far, um, a couple of which with the 2016 weekend parade and celebrations at Highwood and then in 2019 the weekend at Denham. Both amazing weekends, thoroughly enjoyable and very well attended, paying respects and homage to our past and also looking to our future. I know that for many years you've also supported the Brigade and leaded our contingent at the National Remembrance Service in London. Um, which has always been a high point to the calendar. Um, this role, as you know, is not necessarily a glamorous one, and like every, every self-respecting brigade officer, the sleeves get rolled up and you get stuck in to the nitty-gritty and um, help wherever you can. This is more than evident at the National Band Weekends, where I've been told you don a penny, peel potatoes, hoover the halls and do lots of cleaning. You also have supported National Band for many years with the music competition, which again is really high regarded and very popular. This amazing organisation only glows, grows and flourishes because of the amazing people that take part in it. You are one of those amazing people and the history and the future of the Brigade is part of you. It is therefore with great pleasure and a huge honour to me today to present you with the Brigade Cross. As you know, this is the Brigade's highest award. Please wear it with pride. It signifies the huge amount of effort and time you have dedicated to this organisation. When lockdown's over and we can all meet again, I look forward to meeting you soon for a glass of something very refreshing and bubbly. But in the meantime, enjoy your day and thank you for all your hard work and effort. Congratulations, Martin. <laughs> Thank you, Stephen. <laughs>